What's that? Well, it's gonna, it's, it's something like I said, you do it and you get out of it. It's not something you can hold forever because it gives you a lot of that compression of your wrist. Good, but some people, yes, three. And then for three, are you ready? That was great. <laughs> Yes, I'm in my car filming again. I'm a little bit early, so I figured I would just do a little update. Um, not too much going on since yoga is done. I was sick last week and I feel so much better now. And I realized through all this time, I have not been spending uh, the time I need on my weight training. And although I've never really um, minded feeling thin, or skinny I've never I can't say I've ever been skinny but um, uh, I lost weight between walking the dog for all these months and then being sick and stressed out there was a lot going on in my life this past year and I realized that I lost muscle so um, I probably weigh less now than I did I don't know since high school um, so yeah that's super cool I could wear you know my clothes but I also know that I lost muscle so I need to make a solid effort now um, to build it back up. So I teach uh, a cardio and the sculpting class on Monday. I teach uh, like a cardio interval sculpting combo on Tuesday. I do a spin class on Thursday and then Friday I have um, a class that's all weights which is awesome. I love that one. Um, but the other classes are mostly small weights, high repetitions which is good for my arms but I don't really get a good workout for like my back, my chest, my legs. Um, so I definitely need to spend some time in the gym doing heavier lifting. So if I even just designate like a half hour, two to three times a week, heavy lifting, um, I will gain it right back. I mean, muscle memory, I've been muscular my whole life. So yep, that's my new plan. So I got to teach a fitness class for the Transform Fitness Group through the church I go to. Church Alive has all these different Transform groups. They do for men, they do for women, couples. And this time they were doing a nine week Transform Fitness Group. Um, so I thought it would be nice to volunteer to teach one of the classes one day. And today was my day and um, I don't know, there were at least like 35 women, I think. Um, looked like a great turnout and everybody was so motivated and excited and um, it was like a cardio interval class. We had some weights, some bands, but um, I didn't really know what to expect, but it was a lot of fun and I'm looking forward to doing it again. Hopefully they'll want me to come back. Hey, bad boy. So we've been working with the trainer and um, they suggested to try putting peanut butter into the muzzle and let him, you know, lick the peanut butter out so his face is in the muzzle for an extended period of time and keep on doing that. That's the cage muzzle. We also have the soft one that we put over his leash and it just kind of dangles in his face when I'm walking them to desensitize them to that one. Okay. 
Okay, I almost, but he felt it. Let's try again. He's gonna overdose on peanut butter today. No more. No more. No more. Come here. Stop. No more. No more. No more. Good boy. Good boy. Here. 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 Later. Good boy. Good boy. 